Hello folks, today we're gonna to create a grid on this piece of paper and the grid is gonna to be to be able to accurately draw the, the picture that we're looking about looking at that already has the grid on it. Our grid that we're looking at has nine squares total. That's three squares across, three squares down. So what we need to do is create a grid on here to transfer it to. We are gonna create three inch squares on our grid from here to here. However, if you have a piece of paper that is not quite nine inches across one way and nine inches the other way, then you're gonna to need to probably shrink the grid down to two inches. So that means instead of doing the three inch measurements, you'll do two inches so that you can have the entire square for the entire grid. So if you have an eight and a half by 11 piece of paper, you'll have to do two inch squares instead of three. But this video, I'm actually gonna show three inch squares because this piece of paper is large enough. Now, we're gonna always start from the left side and um, I'm going to put little marks. I don't, I don't wanna just draw lines because we don't know if my lines are gonna be straight. So what I'm gonna do is at each three inch spot, I'm gonna put a little dot, not a dash, just a little tiny dot. Can you see it? It's really small. And then three inches later, I'm gonna go one, two, three. I'm gonna put another little dot because I can go directly to a dot. I don't know how exactly sometimes the dashes get crooked. And then I'm gonna go three more inches. One, two, three. So at this point, I've got one, two, three little dots, and they're each three inches apart. Then, instead of drawing a line to go to some random place, I can draw a dot starting from the top, just like I did before. I'm gonna start from the top. You always start from the same side, so if I started from the top on this side, I have to start on the top from this side. And I'm gonna go one, two, three, and put a little dot not a dash. Then I'm going to go one, two, three, put a little dot, and then one, two, three. So now I went all the way, it's uh, if you look at the total, it's all the way down to the nine inch spot. So I'm going to, now I can just draw each dot to the corresponding dot across the paper. So I'm going to line up the first two dots and draw a very nice light line. And why do I want to draw the line lightly? So that I can erase it later. Now I've drawn it a little bit darker for you, but you really want to draw it light because you don't want to keep the grid. After you draw the picture, you want to erase the grid. So I'm going to line up the next set of dots. One, two, three, I want to the next set of dots. And draw the third line, which is line up those two dots. If you don't draw a dot that's measured on both sides, you're going to end up with really crooked lines, and then you're going to wonder why it looks like that. So now we can do the lines going the opposite direction. So I'm going to, I just have three sets of blocks that we're going to do, right? So I'm going to start at the top and go every three inches. So one, two, three, and I'm going to put a little dot. One, two, three, and I'm going to put a little dot. And let's just make sure this is right at three inches. One, two, three, it's right on the line. It's right at three inches. Now, I'm gonna go down to the bottom of this third box because I know this lower stuff down here is not part of my grid. It's just extra paper. I just need these three sections for this grid because we're making a square. So I'm gonna go down to the lower line and I started from the left side. So that's where I'm gonna start again, not from the right side. I started from the left, so I'm always gonna start from the left side there. So I go one, two, three, put a little dot, and then I go one, two, three, another three inch little dot, and then one, two, three, and it goes off right at the edge. So now I've got a dot that I started from the left side lined up with this dot that I started from the left side. If I'd started it from the right side, it would have been crooked. So you always have to start on the same side every time. Now I'm gonna take the two first dots and line them up, and I will have a perfectly straight line for my grid. And I'm going to lightly connect them. And I only did these three because that's the part that I'm using for the grid. And then I'm going to go to the next two dots, line them up with my ruler. And connect the line. Very lightly. So now I have a nine square grid with three by three inch squares all the way around. It's prepped and ready to go to draw my photo. I'll draw up my picture from my photo.